The human body was meant to move. Our joints, muscles, and even our minds benefit from getting up and moving around. It's how we stay healthy, strong, and positive. Yet, in today's busy workplace, we move less and less. We've engineered movement right out of our days. We don't even have to get out of our chairs to talk or meet. That's great for business, but our bodies are suffering. In the average workday, we sit for nearly nine hours. And in a 24-hour day, we're sedentary for all but three of them. That's 21 hours sitting still. Unfortunately, even a daily 30 or 60 minute trip to the gym won't counteract these steadily mounting effects. The problem with prolonged sitting is compounded, adding up to body deterioration that cannot be undone in a short burst of better behavior. All day stillness adds up to serious health effects, including increased risk for diabetes, obesity, and disability later in life. In fact, people with sitting jobs have two times the rate of cardiovascular disease as people with standing jobs. Not to mention the daily, I don't want to get out of bed blues. Sitting for long periods slows the brain's ability to regulate body functions, affecting hormones, metabolism, and mood. Studies show that a sedentary lifestyle increases symptoms of depression and anxiety. With your internal system out of balance, your body's ability to regulate good cholesterol drops by 20%, caloric burn drops to one calorie per minute after two hours of sitting, and electrical activity in your leg muscles shuts off as soon as you take a seat. Your body enters sleep mode. With health risk on the horizon, in movement, works to redesign today's office space to help employees adopt new workplace behavior and integrate small movement back into their day. We're in movement. We're bringing movement back to work.